Yeah, I wonder. I don't know if like, he was watching Canines, Danny versus Mago, but I would love to see him adopt the same things. Yeah, it doesn't seem like it's over because both times he tried to pull a banana. Oh, that's yeah, true. <laughs> he actually, he had it at the ledge, like ledge trapped, and then like he was still trying to pull a banana. Yeah. But it was funny since he couldn't pull a banana, he actually kept hitting him. Instead. Yeah. <laughs> like <laughs> because the banana would come, I was like, oh, I actually have to focus on hitting him now because yeah, I don't yeah. know where banana is. Yeah, it's funny. But uh, really good start already. All right, let's see what the edge guard is here. See if he covers ledge jump. Nope. Goes for the banana. Yeah, he's not. He's letting Mago get back on for free. He just felt, he's kind of tunnel visioning on that banana itself. It's a really good tool, but he, he, don't don't let your opponent get back on for free. Yeah. yeah. Especially just because they can cover like these ledge jumps really easily. Oh yeah. Like it's no problem. We saw K9 do it earlier. He was just not letting Mago touch the stage at all. All right. Ooh, good reaction on the down oh, tilt. Oh, I got so scared. I thought he was gonna get like reverse fair to some like crazy combo. All the reverse fair to bear. Yeah. It might have killed like with the Ragey highs on Smashville too. Ugh. Actually, yeah. It would have because the reverse fair knocks you back quite a distance. Oh, but that back air. Yikes! That di straight off stage. This is fine for Mago because he's BBW is back at death percent. That is true. I wonder if BBW recognizes this. I would just run now. I would run, but it doesn't seem like he's running at all. It's Ouch. He has died to that <laughs> three times. Yeah, I would just, just like I would just run away, dude. Just I, I don't take like some tilt damage, like anything to get me out of like the window, honestly. Yeah, he's Yeah, I feel like BBW is focusing way too much on banana in this matchup and less of Getting Mago off stage. Yeah, if he, he's using Banana as like the main tool instead of the support tool. Yeah. I mean, for the most part, that is a really good idea with Diddy Kong because Banana just controls so much of the stage just from the pure fact that if you get hit by it, you're not moving for a solid chunk of time. And that Diddy Kong hurts in that solid chunk of time, but yeah, uh, it's just the fact that matters. Um, Mago's really good at punishing bad banana pulls. Yeah. And I feel like BW's putting himself in a spot to get caught by that quite a bit when he can just, you know, continue to pressure. Yeah. The one thing you don't want to give the grapplers is space. And BW is kind of giving that away by just kind of pulling up banana at some questionable times. Okay. It's chilling here. But hey, so far it's working a little bit better for BBW now. He does have a slight lead, but he will also die to a grab, like, right now. Yeah. He's got to be careful here. Oh, oh the down beat got rid of the banana, but it's still too much lag on that move. Oh, oh, didn't cover the landing. That was really laggy from Mago. And he hit him out of the jump. Oh, oh got, got the banana the snipe. snipe. Okay, see, now the thing is, Mago could have died first there. Yeah? He wasn't shielding, and the barrels were right next to him. Uh, and he was at a high percent. Those barrels knock you far. I feel like Bowser is still heavy enough to live, though. I mean, I feel like it, but like you never know. Those things knock you pretty far. Oh, you tried. And he was at like 150 percent. Mm, possibly. Yeah. It, it, it was a chance. I'm not saying it was definitely going to happen, but there was that slight chance that it could have happened. It also could have been like the double SD moment, yeah. smash and splash, where uh, barrel yeah. explosion not kills you right as the other person falls. True. But who Either knows? or, uh, yeah, Mario was still getting that first game with the clean banana snipe. Yep. That fire burst is actually a lot better than I thought it was going to be at just stopping Banana from being thrown in. But yeah. BBW, what this a better start this game? Nice. Right. Finally, four aired him for ledge jumping. He probably had the Banana in the spot he perfectly <laughs> wanted at this time. <laughs> All right. This is what you want to do is Diddy. Yeah, this is smash up. All right. There you go. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> You know what? Okay, fine. Just get the banana. Why not? I mean, it'll lead to a kill, so I get it. But you're giving up so much uh, positioning for that. <gasps> oh, I air dodged there. To be honest, <laughs> I died. He did air dodge. I died at 48 there. <laughs> he did air dodge, but he air dodged high. Yeah. But command grab? No. This is scary because just based off his past habits, if he doesn't. <laughs> it almost happened again. Yeah, yeah. That one was safe, though, because I, I know Mario was actually looking for that tiny opening to punish him for pulling Banana, but he was actually good distance on the stage. And, uh, right. yeah, there we go. Not too bad. Now you still run, though. Yeah, you, you're still running because you take 20 more percent 
and you're at death percent, and you're at death percent. <laughs> oh, yeah. all right there. Uh, since Vago is kind of like shielding, I would just run in and grab him. Oh, jeez. Oh, he could have down aired him. He was DIing in on that. All right, well. Slowly but surely, he's coming out of death percent because rage. But yeah. this is actually where Mago and Oh, he hit him out of the air. Oh, oh not enough. He, he got caught by a banana fool. Oh, jeez. Oh, that good. was. Yeah, really good cross up there. He needs to chill, though. Yeah, he's throwing some risky options that if Mago gets one good read, you. Ugh, it's gonna hurt. Yeah. Oh, oh. I thought for a second there he took his double jump. Okay. Pressure to the edge of the stage. Okay. I am confident that if, this, if that platform had been moving left, Mago would have immediately Bowser bombed. Because BBW was, was holding shield on top of the platform. Oh, yeah, that's true. And it was moving right. So I feel like if it was moving left, he immediately would have gone for the Bowser Bomb. Because he hasn't done it this entire set. Oh, big damage. That actually might kill. Uh, it's barely living. How's he going to get to the ledge? It's a, I'm, look, I'm seeing a down tilt, or a tilt kill in general, or side B. That's what Mago might be fishing for now. Oh, jeez. Yeah. No tech chase. Oh, and BW is playing super scary right now. Yeah. He doesn't. Oh, okay. Oh, oh no tech chase again. He uh, doesn't seem to realize that. Oh, that might kill. No, he's barely living. He missed the platform. He doesn't seem to realize that Bowser's <gasps> techs are are really bad. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Oh. Yeah, he might both. Oh, wow. What a trade. The noggin hitting the hands is just. Oof. Man, that's... that's he is right. just getting unfortunate times on everything. Yeah, that's super rough. Uh, uh, you can see the dissatisfaction on his face. Yeah. He was not happy. He was really not happy about that last one. Bad news bears, for sure. Well, Michael going up 2-0 against BBW. One game away from getting double eliminated by Michael's Bowser. Uh, yeah, I don't know. It's just another case of, like, him not just keeping Bowser pinned to the edge. Yeah, just kind of... He, whenever he doesn't do that, he kind of gives Milo the opportunity to just come back. Yeah, he gives up stage control. Uh, don't... I mean, sometimes I can see it's it's worth the trade-off because he gets banana and just throws Mago back off. But, like, a lot of times he's just kind of giving up stage pressure. And Mago gets something like this for free. Okay, Mago's looking for another air dodge. Yeah. Oh, oh my goodness, he just teleported into his oh, arm. He got lucky. He didn't get hit by sweet spot. Oh, it doesn't but it just matter. He, he banana pulled. No, I think he called out the monkey flip. No, he. I think he called the monkey flip, but it looked like BBW also went for a banana pull. Because oh, after the monkey it, Yeah, because oh. his hand, I saw Diddy Kong's hand reel back a bit. Yikes. And I don't know if he has any other animation in air where he kind of reels his hand back. Either or, that was just like a really bad monkey flip. Yeah. And this is where it becomes scary because now Mago has rage. Shouldn't... Is that a decently safe percent? He won't die to most things. There might be one or two confirms that will kill him, but he's pretty safe from everything else. And rage ding or rage up there out there is really good. Okay, not a bad spot here. All right, there it goes. Edge guardian keeping Mago off stage. Is that air dodge? Oh, he's gonna go to the other side. Nice. Yep. All right. Oh. Wow, that was actually really good. So Mago's been doing really good with the, just the get-up attacks. They've been hitting BBW like almost every single time. Oh, that banana was really close to kidding. Oh him. my goodness. The pivot so grab. His okay, he's looking for shield break now. He saw the platform coming and was waiting for the air dodge onto the platform. Nice. Yeah. I've been waiting for him to catch Mago for shielding there with the command grab like the whole time. Alright. So. Uh, yeah, I know he wanted to see if he can first and burn all the jumps there, but just uh, not able to connect. Nice. All right. Oh, good uh, catch. Good catch. And now this is where it becomes scary for him again because one grab. Oh, that was early. Oh, jeez. Oh, I see what my. Oh, he spot dodged. All right, he's barely living. So oh, that was oh. such a that. That the reverse was so risky, dude. That was right on top of him. All right. Oh, oh still dead. He died yeah. out. Oh. He was too focused on avoiding the platform that 
Yeah. That that's rough. Ouch. Alright, so now I believe we get Mago and Kareem. 